Hey everybody, this is Eli with GameWisp, and today we're going to do something a little different than what we normally do. This won't be a full featured Let's Play. This will be a single episode one-off of a game called The Stanley Parable, and this is the demo of the new version of The Stanley Parable. I'm really looking forward to playing it. I don't know if you guys are familiar with this game, but it seems like last year or maybe the year before in 2011 or 12, um, The Stanley Parable was released as a source mod. And it, it came out to kind of big acclaim amongst indie circles, and it kind of got a little bit of mainstream coverage too because it's a really fantastic game. Uh, the original Stanley Parable talked a lot about choice. Um, it talked a lot about the impact of choice and how sometimes those choices don't matter at all. And so it explores some really interesting themes, and it does it all while being wonderfully narrated by a guy that sounds a lot like Tim Curry. So the game's a lot of fun. And this is the demo of the new version that's coming out, standalone from Source. And so it should be really great. Uh, we're gonna dive into it, but first, here's a quick here's a quick look at the website for the Stanley Parable. Um, you can get it at stanleyparable.com. I'm just gonna scroll through. I couldn't find a lot of information about the developers. I admit I didn't look very hard, but it wasn't on their main site for the game. Uh, but check out the site; it has some really cool uh, trailers and things of that nature for the game. So you should definitely take a look. Uh, so without further ado, here we're gonna jump into the Stanley Parable demonstration and just see what it's all about because a lot of people have been raving about the Stanley Parable. Uh, Rock, Paper, Shotgun wrote an article about how great this demo is, as well as some other places. So hopefully it'll be really good. So let's start. Here we are. In kind of a little back alley area, a parking garage. Got a vending machine, probably nothing worth interacting with. Um, I'm gonna make this pretty straightforward. I probably won't try to hunt around and look for too much. Um, this game, well, if it's anything like its predecessor, it's extremely whimsical, very funny, and uh, very deep at the same time. So I'm hoping we're in for something good here. Welcome to the Stanley Parable Demonstration. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. So yeah, we're already being very uh, sort of tongue-in-cheek here and, and poking fun at the idea that, hey, this is a demo. And it's kind of cool, right? Because they've obviously made this very custom um, thing here, a one-off kind of thing for demonstration versus other games which may just give you like a first level and kind of phone it in. They put some thought into this, so I'm, I'm excited. This is going to be good. So we are 28. They are serving number 20. Um, looking around here, we just see kind of a disheveled waiting room. Uh, can we crouch? Yes. Stanley Parable demo mugs. Nice. Uh, Everything's Okay magazine. Alright. Just kind of looking at some of the stuff. Ducks. Who doesn't love a magazine about ducks? Uh, we've got some other photos here, some papers. Um, nothing. <laughs> There's the tester assessments. Nothing really too uh, mind-boggling here. Just some run-of-the-mill stuff. Hopefully, I didn't miss something cool and snarky. I already said I wasn't gonna look around. And what am I doing? I'm just like looking around. Yeah, cool stuff. Okay, so well fleshed out waiting room at least. Looks like a broken window or something. And it's our turn, so let's go. <laughs> Famous demos. Um, yeah, so here's Gunpoint, which is great. That's a fantastic game if you haven't played it. Metal Gear Solid, one or the other. Can't remember which one it is. Uh, there's a Half-Life. And what is this game? Ooh, I don't know. Uh, somebody can tell me. I can't remember. That's sad. I can't remember that. But very cool wall. Famous demos. Once again, going going full sale here, really committing to the dem demo theme. All right. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease, just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? I'm so nervous, Tim Curry. uncertainty. Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 minutes or so? Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill <laughs> of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. I'm a wash in the Stanley Parable. So, yeah. Wonder how long we can just stand here. So this would be the most boring Let's Play ever if I stood here for 20 minutes. So let's take a look around. Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, mm -hmm. tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous <laughs> energy before getting the demo underway. I agree. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. It's the demo of the demo. 
This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect. Which, which is their goal, PS guys. It's totally their goal. And I, I love this. I love that we're going to go through um, how the game looks and get a feel for it, and, and a feel for everything without learning anything at all about the game. Like, this is just fantastic thought and effort to put into this, which is wonderful. It's locked. Demo admin number nine. What are you doing, demo admin? Got some paperwork there. Nice ocean scene. Alright, so let's head down to the uh, demo construction facility. Maybe we're going through here. Oh, this looks ah, fancy. Here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? <laughs> Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press, and we'll see what your choice says about you. Yeah, and so obviously, you know, choice is the big theme, like I've mentioned already with the Stanley Parable, um, and how little that choice can matter. So more, more kind of tongue-in-cheek humor from these guys. I'm just, I'm, I am a wash in this demo. How I think it's great. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? <laughs> you see, our choices really do illuminate Oops. the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. Pervert. <laughs> Love it. Can I press another one? No. Only got the sexual predator one. Well. Okay, what else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. <laughs> Okay, so we can check out some stuff. Um, how about demo status? All right. This De device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Right. Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Are you that eager for the demo to start? <laughs> Don't worry, we're almost there. Fantastic. Uh, compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. That's why we use this room to deliver <laughs> cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single <laughs> sitting as you can. Oh, fan, wonderful. Just look at you go. That's great. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. So snarky. Top 4,700 even. So I snarky. as far as 4,600. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no, you've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room <laughs> for improvement. It's me. Okay, then. What's next? It's me. I'm a flawed individual. True story. I wonder what's down here. Locked. Isolation chamber. All right, maybe I'm, I got a feeling we'll probably see that later. A motion booth. So uh, one of the trailers for this game talks about the emotion booth. Here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, step into one of them, and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. <laughs> And um, it's it's on their website that I showed earlier in the video talking about emotion booths and it, re really funny gag, um, you know since we're just gluttons for punishment and terrible people we're gonna do despair, and it's Where a soothing green. Where did these green. gifts go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own Having a mustache. spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now. Would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Perhaps it was the cold I desired most of all. That empress to whom my flesh was always invisible. A hammock for the bones. 
waiting to be touched and to be known. Good stuff. Good stuff. Can I can I do discovery? Well, let me do this. Yes. And within the shame he Walls. carried that ocean breeze give him the fierceness of the tides, Good stuff. the inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping and tearing at the eternal seams, a vessel without a captain, carrying itself like plastic in the wind, hinting at a purpose that was truer in some distant memory. If only it could decipher through time's veneer whose memory it wanted to be. These all seem like things that could go in a Cards Against Humanity deck, which is pretty funny. Um, let's take a look around. Uh, can we get another ones? Now, now, we have to save at least a few <laughs> emotions for the full game. Embarrassment. Emotion booth. Confusion. Yeah, so good stuff. And this is like, like I said, this is a really tongue-in-cheek thing. Um that they did in a particular trailer. So it's cool to see that come to fruition in the demo. I don't see oh, it making it to the final. You went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. So here's a couple, there's a Dory Mist um, wall technology, so we'll go take a look at that. No, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead, give it a shot. <laughs> This isn't gonna work. Oh, hmm. <laughs> I guess it's still in development. Right. Okay, moving along. Wonderful, wonderful little gag there. So as far as demos go, this is really just uh, hitting all the right buttons for me. Super, super funny stuff. Cool view, by the way. How's the anticipation? Still feeling it? I'm tingling with anticipation. All right, so we've got final choice here. That one's broken. Here's some art. If you were unaware, that is art. Final choice. <laughs> Do you like the Stanley Parable? Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been <laughs> No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision true. without savoring it first? It's true. Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. All right. You win, Stanley Parable. There you have it. Non demonstration. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Oh, we got concerns. some more left. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, and generally being mental, a dick. physical, or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Nothing? No objection? <laughs> You're quite sure uh, about that? Oh, you know, we need that button then. anyway. In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna dance. Please perform a dance. <laughs> yeah, get down. Let's crash a little. Yeah, crash. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything <laughs> you see inside the demo, perform that dance and I will terminate the demo immediately. So let's right. crouch a All lot preparations and have been made. move like it an idiot. Is time at last. Look, we're not going to play this demo. It's not going to happen. The Stanley Parable. Really? We're going to do this? I just knew we wouldn't get it. All right. So... Series of rooms. Oh, <laughs> oh wait, what? what are we doing Welcome here? To the Classic. Demonstration. Your number is 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Just okay. Uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. Wonderful. Let's just run through. Cool. Famous demos. Good to see you again. And by the way, this is very indicative of how the Stanley Parable plays if you've okay, never played it. Here we go. The Stanley Parable demo take two. 
finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is, here it comes. All right, let's do this. Let's do this on demo. Eight. Oh, wait, what's this? Eight. Eight. Yeah, I'll push that. <laughs> Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's, Eight. This is all wrong. This isn't the Stanley Parable. This is a game where you press a button and it says eight. Indeed. Not only is the Stanley Parable not a game about continuously pressing the number eight, I can guarantee that this button does not appear anywhere in the main I game. I don't believe it. Why is it here instead of the demo for the Stanley Parable? Where did the demo go? There was an actual demo here before. Something has gone wrong. It's all gone horribly wrong. We need to get you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley Parable based on whatever the hell this eight game is. We need to get out. We need to start over. You mustn't stay here another minute. Out, out, out. Go, go, go. All right. Away we go. It's very white. Thinking. You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about. None whatsoever. Truth. So, sorry if there was a random jump cut right there. Uh, had a visitor. Had to, had to take care of that. But anyway, we're going to keep going. Alright, so... Alright, so let's see what else we got here. Back in the waiting room. Back... Six. Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, Demonstration. Your number is 30. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, mm. and have a pleasant demonstration. Oh, glitch no, in the no, matrix, no perhaps. time for exploration. <laughs> We've got business to attend to. Indeed, indeed we do. We should get out of here. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the 8 game rather than the Stanley Parable. <laughs> but I think it's, it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. At this time, please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. Think about mistakes. I should have danced better. I should have danced better. I got nothing else. Wonderful. I could really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall third. truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Let the demonstration begin. What? It's just black. Please go back to the very beginning. It's totally awesome. <laughs> Can't be over yet. You didn't see anything. Everything that was supposed <laughs> to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience. I think you've done it, guy. I think you've done it. It was here somewhere. I'm sure of it. Oh no, 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do. Anything. The demo cannot end like this. Ah, uh, hurry, hurry, this way. Storage. Okay. Yes. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. How about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. All right, now put it um, um, in the bin. <laughs> in the bin. Gotcha, guy. It's like American Gladiators up in here. You did it! You won! You know what you Powerball get for winning? Reference. An achievement. Wow, the Stanley it. Parable just keeps getting better and better. In fact, let me take <laughs> a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? Hey man, you know it. Uh, you responded. What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. You really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. Oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't we? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. All right. Ending, ending. Where are you? <laughs> Where are you? Uh, is this it? 
Is it? Yes. And <laughs> now this is where we want the demo to be over. Got it. I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Yes. Is it working? Are, are you sure? <laughs> you sure you press the button? I'm trying, bro. What? No. We, we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. <laughs> I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? We need to go back. We need to get out of here. Again? All right. Let's run away. Again. You know, it's really kind of mind-blowing that this demo is doing so much with so little. Um, just really great stuff. Oh, no. What's going on? Where oh, is everyone? Oh, jeez. Okay. Over to the left. Down this way. Okay, so here's the door that was locked earlier. Now we're going to go through there and see what's up in the isolation room. I don't want to. Oh man! Now I'm isolated. Oh, nice and quiet. Finally. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher, and I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be, but but somehow I couldn't. But you did, because yeah. this is a Stanley well, Parable to a T. At any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley <laughs> Parable anymore. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? Absolutely not. Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No. I think I've had enough of it. No more doors. No more demonstrations. No more endings. That's the other problem with this game. There's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, but back at the beginning of the demonstration, now oh, that was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going. No confusion, just a blank slate. Truth. Yes, yeah, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey, <laughs> do you remember, just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time, and I showed you the technology used to make the demo, because I thought there actually was a demo. <laughs> oh, we were so naive back then, how little we knew of the world. And then, when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before. Yes. It's just <laughs> walking me through the demo of they not a demo. Such wonderful moments. Oh, and then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere and we just kept climbing and climbing that, flight this after didn't flight happen. after flight. I thought they would never end. And then we were on some kind of catwalk. I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? And we just kept going, and we found that elevator, and it said escape on it. And we talked about it for a while, about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but huh. it seemed worth a try. And at the very least, it would be an adventure. So we got inside, and we rode the elevator up and up and up. And we had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when. And then after so long, it finally stopped. And we stepped out into the lush outdoors. Did we? The trees, the wildlife, the sun rising on a new and glorious path. Freedom. We were free. I don't think we're free. There was nothing to think, nothing to know. Simply us being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? Wasn't that moment? So singularly, piercingly beautiful. Oh, we, oh, we getting it? No, we're not. So now we're in an office, and that's probably where the game actually starts. Um, so, in terms of demonstration quality, I think this is probably one of the most cerebral and flat-out intelligent demos I've ever played. Uh, just the fact that they can demonstrate the mechanics of the game, the wit of the game, um, and the overall narrative feel and what the game expects you to do in a game that is in no way reflective of the actual game is, is quite an impressive feat. Uh, so I can tell you for certain I'm really looking forward to this. This is a demo you should all go play. It's it's pretty good stuff. I mean, you know, source game, controls pretty standard, uh, graphics about what you'd expect, you know. Um, 
so all pretty standard box standard stuff there but just the the intelligence that goes into the writing and and the way this thing is put together is really really just kind of incredible so go play it uh, i'm excited the game drops i think on october 17th i will definitely be buying it um i got the demo on steam i'll probably get the game there but i'm sure there are alternative links uh that others may feel free to add in the comments of this video if they would like but yeah keep an eye on this guys and if you haven't played the stanley parable uh, the old one that was on the source uh, was done as a source mod. Go play that. Check it out. Know what you're getting into. Uh, just really good stuff. Really intelligent stuff. And you're missing out if you don't play it. Uh, some final administrative notes. Got a lot of positive feedback from the To the Moon Let's Play I did with Jessica. So uh, we will be doing a Let's Play very soon, Jessica and I, on another game from the wonderful people at Ice Pick Lodge. Uh, so keep an eye out for that. It's not their new game. It's another one that's much more trippy and crazy so we're gonna play that and i will probably look into some other games some future let's plays we got some more stuff coming out on game wisp um if you're watching this on youtube and not game wisp i recommend you check us out that is gamewisp.com you can come take a look at our site built around let's plays and save game sharing and and the community we've developed there and things of that nature so yeah come check us out come check out the stanley parable and there's no excuse for you not to check out the stanley parable demonstration go play it it's a lot of fun very tongue-in-cheek and who knows what I missed out on running through the demo myself. So go check it out. See what else you can find. Talk to you later, guys.